What's up, guys? Welcome back for the next episode of The Last Stand Aftermath. Where the hell are we? Can't remember where we chose to go. Either way, uh, we've got a antiviral. I'm going to use it. Where are we going? Three areas that way. Hey, guys. That is satisfying. Grenade launcher? Yo. Game, you messed up. You gave me a grenade launcher. <laughs> Haven't even used the M16 yet. You guys messed up. <coughs> <laughs> oh yeah, that's a that's a special occasion kind of gun, right there. Whew. Freaking kibbles and bits. Lining up for me, boys. Don't have a whole lot of ammo for this, but we'll use it while we can. Some more nine ammo. There's the gas over there. There's the antiviral. Oh, look at this guy. He's still up! And he's down. Dedicate that combat role to you, Zavalin. So tactical. <laughs> Mark blows zombie into pieces, but supplies are intact. Yes, Mark. That is how it works. Ta-da. Spiked board. Give him that spiked board. Coup de gras. <laughs> Call that a smart bomb. Exactly. Only destroys what what uh, what you want it to. <laughs> Another throwable crappy grenade. Another perfect time for an antiviral. Can only make one? Can only make one. Okay. I guess that kind of makes sense. Hey, more 7.62. I've got literally one round of 5.56 five, left other than what I've got in the mag. That's, uh... Great! We are gonna need more fuel. Nice barrel attachment. Laser. It's a lazy beam.
Uh, Zablin, so are you trying to get the health bar all yellow? No, no, no. What the antiviral does is it just slows the infection rate of mutations. Mutations are those purple bursts that hit me every once in a while. Those, uh, those are actively taking away my health pool. Okay, you're in a weird position. So, no matter what, you're gonna die in the game. It's just a matter of how long you can last. It is a roguelite, after all. Yeah. So, you kinda, kinda gotta use what you gotta use here. If you know what I mean. So, now we've got a little laser. It's not like the most reliable laser, but... <laughs> whatever. Uh, there's a supply thing here. We're gonna keep doing this just to get as much time as possible out of it. So yeah, as your mutation stacks up, you uh, just have less and less health bar. It's kind of kind of have to prioritize certain things, I suppose. Like, I gotta use this last bullet, right? <laughs> eh, let's use the mine. Scope, grenade, 5.56. Five, I mean, the 5.56 five, five, is awfully tempting, but I'm gonna activate the beacon instead. Bump. Right in the face. In the face! Yeah, Scary Stories to Tell in the Dark wasn't great. Rural neighborhood. Can't go to the motel. We can go halfway to the hotel. So, I guess we're going to Danby Creek. I wonder if we're going to get to go to, like, a big city. You know? Like with skyscrapers and shit. That could be cool. Imagine having to gun down a whole horde coming down the whole street. That'd be pretty neato. Either that or they're just gonna be sticking to like the smaller... Oh! Locations. <laughs> Radio static. It's Trinity. What have you got? Looks like a military base. Probably Herc. This is a good opportunity. We don't have any information about what happened out there. Get inside and see what you can find. Uh, what am I looking for? Kept records of logistics, troop movements, lots of shit. Might give us some idea of what's out there. Okay. I need fuel anyway. Got four buildings to go to. Oh, there's an antiviral. Keep that in mind. Felt like a good use for that. Oh, 
Okay, there's mines, apparently. Claymores, maybe? Something? I would imagine that they're tripwires. If I had to guess... No, I do not want to do that right now. Lots of antiviral. Ooh, more stuff. Okay, let's see. Uh, M4A1, huh? Well, I'm pretty sure the M4A1 will have full auto as opposed to the burst. But I don't know which would be better for us to use. I can't keep one of them, that's for sure. I can repair it at the next crafting station. I don't know. I'll hold on to it for now. 89 out of 50 doesn't really matter. <laughs> Not like we have any ammo for it anyway. rounds left. One extra. Alright. Looks like we're gonna be rolling with this for a little while. 7.62. Man, if I could get a hunting rifle, then that would be pretty pretty decent. But other than that... is opening. To be honest, I was expecting a little bit more fanfare for opening that. Going crazy with the ammo. Because why not? Oh, hi, big guy. Got you. 
Okay. So we're out of ammo for that guy. Going back to the Death Adder. Need to stop running around like I own the place. There was already ex an explosion we saw, so I need to be a little bit more careful. Is this going to open? Okay. Key card, huh? Oh, really? A key card? Hey. Hey, look at us. Getting key cards and shit. Damn. What's this? Oh, requires a battery. I don't have a battery. Yet. <laughs> Fawn's wishes. Neat. We got little extra ways to get in. Okay. Uh, we got a lot of random crap. Okay. Can we do anything right now? We can make more bandages. Hardly seems necessary. Information. Informate. General Order 17. Herc, go 17. Go, go, go. Action to carry out termination of remaining quarantine subjects herein after referred to as Operation Aftermath. Eh, he said he said the, said the name. Uh, purpose, removal of compromised subjects and final extraction of homeland environmental risk control agents and operatives from the dead zone. Yeah, he said it. Dead Zone was another one of the titles from the games. Okay. This is, does, does play, take place in the United States. Confirmed. We're screwed. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Two FOB Vanguard from Herc Command. Order. Movement of Supply Order 066 to Warehouse Delta at Grid B944 is to occur immediately following this order. Additional distributors and related equipment is to be returned to... 
Checkpoint Bradley. Troop movement. All station troops at FOB Vanguard will then report to the secondary extraction point as outlined in previous orders. References. As per previous order. In order to complete objectives, troops are free to engage compromised subjects. Hmm. Fuck you, Cooper. General Order 17. Yeah, so on and so forth. Uh, okay. Research and containment. So on and so forth. Punitive order. Blah, blah, blah. Mm hmm, 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 hmm. Mm hmm, hmm. Mm hmm. Stop that damn yawn. I will not. Trinity, do you copy? You made it. Barely. Okay, so what'd you find? Order to kill compromised subjects? Yeah, we've seen those before. Seems like they gave up on testing and trying to figure out who was sick. Is there anything else? Mention of a radio tower? Okay. Sorry to jump in the line here, Trinity. You said there was a radio tower? Yeah, not far from here. Trinity, this is our chance. If we can get access to that tower... There's no time to be chasing signals. We need supplies. If they're using a tower as a relay, there's a larger base out there somewhere. If we find the source, we'll discuss this later. Let me ask something else. Was there anything else? Mention of a warehouse. Okay, okay, that sounds promising. If they were setting up military camps, there would have been a supply chain. The warehouse could be the one. It's, it's a logistics order. We need to find out what they were moving. Any amount of supplies we can get is good at this point. Look into it. Let me ask something else. Uh, nope, that's it. Okay, find that warehouse. Keep track of your location. Good luck. Out. Seeker. Had to stop in at work before heading home to get two of the cooks straight. Now we're heading home, just listening. Well, Seeker, I'm glad you're here. I've made it a pretty decent way in this, uh, this little go go around here. It's not going to be too much longer though until we keel over. Because the times, oh boy, the times they are a changing. So on and a so forth. A lot of you boys out here. I don't know. I don't know if I'll find a cure. I mean, the, the whole point of these types of games is to not find a cure. There was a little thing to do up here. Oh, I missed it. Right. Oh, right, that needed a battery. That's what it was. Go. Find a temporary cure. That's what the antiviral is. It's a temporary cure. It's more of a treatment, really, though. Alright, so now we're back onto the rural neighborhood, the one place we were actually going to originally. <laughs> yeah. Zavlin, you 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 definitely told me. Okay. Two spots to search here. Shouldn't be too crazy filled with zombies. Hey. 
he said as he gets bum rushed. Oh, shit! What the hell? <laughs> I did not see that guy coming up from behind. <laughs> Alright. I'll have to uh, be a little bit more careful for those guys. Dang. Came up out of nowhere. I mean, it's not my first death, I don't think. No, I, no my first character died. The tutorial character died, so I mean... Well, okay, so there was like... Prologue character, and then there was tutorial character from the shotgun trap, and then this is the like character character. So yes, I guess technically my first character death. What do we got here? Uh, so we went medic last time. Um, I think I'm gonna do animal hand. Starts off with the Toron, or we could start off with the the raider loadout. I'll leave it up to you guys in chat. What you guys think I should play as? Um, I don't know how long that last episode was. But anyway, that's going to do it for that episode. If you guys liked it, feel free to hit that like button, leave a comment down below, so on and so forth. I don't know how long that episode was. It was probably a bit shorter because it was a two-parter, but whatever. It is what it is. Um, thanks for watching, guys. 